So could you benefit by the global uncertainty? We think you might be able to, especially home buyers. Got to stay tuned to the National Real Estate Cafe with Don Gatling and Gino Fronti to find out more. So I think this is a little bit of old news, Don, because they've already benefited from global uncertainty. They're that benefiting from Brexit, impeachment, uh, bombs being dropped Oops. wherever they get dropped trade in war. Iran. Trade, trade war is a trade big war has been the big one. It's the really, big one. It's for the sure. big one that made a big difference because yeah. the trade war led to uncertainty that could cause a global recession. So it's not just uncertainty in general; it's uncertainty that can undermine financials globally. And it also has a lot to do with confidence. Confidence levels is imperative, believe it or not, to the not even just in the U.S. but global uh, economic outlook because. If you're confident, then you go out and spend. So spending, what's it, two-thirds of, yeah, it's yeah. a huge percentage of the GDP is, is actually Consumer spending. Consumer spending, yeah. So a big piece. So this article right here, we can go to it. Basically, they're, they're rehashing something that, like Gino said, has already been happening, but they're saying it could continue even further down the line if there is more global uncertainty due to stuff like the trade wars. Yeah, and the biggest benefit is as, ten, as the 10-year bond goes down, in yield, which is, we've, you've heard of negative interest rates ar across the world. Here we're still in the 1.8s, the 1.7s, depending on any given day. They're talking about if it goes down to 1.6, you could have interest rates in the low threes instead of the mid to high threes. That's not entirely true, but it's sometimes they move together, sometimes they don't move together. So rates could stay the same even if the 10 year got better. It's unlikely, but they could. So just it could benefit us more if there's some uncertainty. But then again, there's uncertainty. So remember that that's still a problem. Okay, here's the other thing that we wanted to bring up because a lot of you will read an article like this and say, oh, rates could go into 3.5% or 3.3% again. I'm going to wait. That's silly due to the fact that A, houses will appreciate between now and then because rates are low. That means people will go out and buy homes. That means appreciation. We figure appreciation levels between 45 to 5% next year. That's money you could be losing. And if you're in the home and rates go down, refinance. That's right. Okay, so this even if it costs you money <coughs> or a little bit higher interest rate, so no, no money in your pocket, one way or another you can refinance and still get the lower rate and collect the appreciation value plus the benefit of home ownership. Math. Average cost of a refinance, $3,500. Mm -hmm. 5% appreciation on $500,000, $25,000. $25,000 minus $3,500. Good trade. Winner, winner, chicken <laughs> dinner. So don't wait. Get into a home. Enjoy the home. There's nothing like home ownership. We've been doing this, this you know, financing of the homes for a long time. Been doing it for three decades. It is amazing. Please get in home. Talk to a direct lender. Talk to your local real estate agent because inventories are tight. You need local professionals to guide you down the right path to home ownership. And you can always get these sent to your phone by texting NREC to the number 58885 or. Speaking of our path, Actually, I was going to not only invite them to donandgino.com, but I was going to invite them to MomentumBuilderEvent.com. Mm -hmm. That's our event that we're putting on on March 5th at the Universal Sheraton. It's going to be amazing. We have great speakers that are not only going to help you if you're in the mortgage and real estate business. They can help you if you're in any sort of sales-related business because they're going to help you understand psychology, people's clients and how to make raving super fans. It's super important. All right. You heard it right here on the National Real Estate Cafe. Thanks for tuning in.